A new and developed story out of Brighton. 37 years in the making, police are now sharing more details about the 1982 axe murder of Kathleen Krosinek. On Friday, her husband, Jim Krosinek, was arrested for the crime. Krosinek's three-year-old daughter was in the house at the time of the murder. Kayla Green has the story. Investigators say a fresh look is what helped them start to look at this case a little bit differently. They say timeline and DNA evidence or lack thereof is what helped them make an arrest. I believe the timeline will put Jim Krausnick at home in the house during the commission of the crime. So there, so there was no... Again, there was no outside party in that house during the commission of that crime. Dave Cathaldi is the Brighton police chief. He says DNA, or lack thereof, can speak volumes. Krausnick's attorney says he's been nothing but cooperative through this whole process. He is nothing but innocent, uh, and we believe that after trial he will be found not guilty as well. Gary Printy was an investigator on the case since day one. He says he was happy they took a fresh look at the case in 2015. Printy says he'll never forget arriving to the scene that day. It was not a pleasant scene. I, it was the first one that I had ever seen this violent. And I hope I never see another one. Police say they hope to get justice for the victim's family, who say they'll be attending the trial, which will be happening next year. In Brighton, Kayla Green, News 8. Thank you, Kayla. And the next court date will be late January. There will be a hearing date in early March, and the trial is expected to begin next June 2nd.